What's up, everybody? Yeah, this is the first solo broadcast of Spellball in my team. I have no way to You're You're asking why I don't have anybody with you, Jordan. You've never done this by yourself. Yeah, I fucking know, but I need to branch out and nobody fucking shows up in my house. But that's neither here nor there, nor is it your problem. Um, <clears throat> basically... What I'm trying to do here is just have a, a fun show where we can shoot the shit. I can bring on my comic friends and my musician friends and, and my porn star friends and just have at it. Like, I, I don't see why in today's society everybody needs to be so hung up on the concepts of what it is to be... Uh, in in the entertainment business all three of those professions are entertainment related yet we're all fucked in the head in the head all my comic friends that are a little fucked in the head every porn star I've ever met is fucked in the head uh, and basically it's it's <laughs> it's it it's it's hard. I can't even think about like it's. Wow, I, I, we've all got something. Now, like for those of you who know me personally, that's most likely drugs and my my parents. For me, uh, anybody who knows certain friends of mine no chances are it's drugs and their parents for them as well so there seems to be those in common so basically uh, the, the first thing that I wanted to get to here was the AVN awards last night and the the big thing <clears throat> that I wanted to address is why is it that the AVNs are not streamed live online? Now, if you think about it, every porn star has a webcam, or some of them have their own goddamn networks. Why the fuck wasn't anybody on that shit? I would have been all, I, I, I was literally looking for a link to watch it. And I couldn't find one. Uh, I know they used to film it uh, back in the day and, and put it up on uh, here in Canada. It was called a movie network. It's still around today. But it's it's not the greatest considering we've got Netflix and, and Show Me and all these top-of-the-line streaming services. The movie network is pointless, so I can understand where they're coming from, but it's 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 one of these catch twenty twos, I guess, because yeah, it costs money to 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 do a broadcast, but uh, and they can't advertise during it because the chances are there's p nobody's gonna want to advertise for porn, but like I don't see why. Like, I don't get it. I just don't get it. And sorry if I seem a little bit distracted to people. Uh, I'm I'm literally trying uh, to text message somebody uh, at the exact same time. Uh, but <laughs> I just uh, wanted to reiterate what I was tweeting last night. That... Uh, some of the models from last night's award shows are going to be joining me in the next coming weeks, months, and the next year until they knew the next AVNs, let's be honest now. Uh, and we're, we're going to shoot the shit. I'm going to find out the ins and outs of the AVNs. And I'm going to try and get there next year. <sighs> so... I've also been doing a lot of stand-up recently. Now, this is uh, something new for me, and it, it's been 
a huge learning experience. It's, it's something that I've wanted to do for a long time. It's something I thought I, I, I was capable of doing. I, I wasn't sure, but I don't think anybody can be sure when jumping into a field like this. But I've heard nothing but good things back from everybody who's had me at their open mics. Um, I, I'm getting laughs. Uh, I'm I'm writing constantly, performing at least two, three times a week, uh, all over the city. Uh, it's 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 something that uh, it's it, it's obviously going to be a huge learning curve, but. <laughs> there's there's nothing I can do about that. It's just a matter of getting up there, doing the thing, and uh, fucking telling your jokes. And a huge thanks to fucking Dan Guyrie, who I'm going to have back on the podcast, because he's been a huge, huge mentor for me during this process. And uh, a special thanks to Steve Simone, Don Barris, Tony Hinchcliffe, Amanda Day, Rob Mayu, Catherine Ferns, and all the rest of the comics that I'm I'm forgetting. Joel West, can't forget Joel. Joel's going to be joining me on the podcast shortly in the next uh, probably in the next week because uh, I want to get back into his room, awesome little room down on Danforth on Saturday nights at the Red Rocket Ca- Coffee at uh, Danforth and Monarch Park, right down the street from where I used to go to high school. So can't fucking lose with that. Um, now, I don't, I don't know how long I'm gonna go for the first little set here. Um, it is fucking four o'clock in the morning, but I'll be back first thing to do another podcast in the morning, and this is gonna be a common occurrence. Now, I haven't done any show prep, but I wanted to go over a few things on the Twitter, and, uh, one of those, uh... Justin Bieber is uh, suing, apparently, some shit. Uh, Sorry, my phone is fucking going off. Uh, uh, Sorry, dead air. Oh, okay, back to what I was saying. Sorry about that, everybody. So, basically, what I'm trying to say is Justin Bieber is in the news again. Obviously, he's always in the fucking news. Uh, he's try- He's agreed to be roasted by Comedy Central. Now, this is something that should have happened with more than Justin Bieber. It should have been happening for a while now. And I'm not just talking like like how they did Pam Anderson and James Franco and, and Charlie Sheen and all and, and, and the Hoff. Those people obviously deserve to be roasted in their own right. But the the roasting was a tradition for so many years and it, they roasted their friends, they roasted their loved ones. Now Anybody who does something fucked up can be roasted. So, <clears throat> if this had been going on with the musicians for longer, it, it it like how Frank Sinatra and all those guys were doing them back then, I could understand <clears throat> them wanting to make uh, a, a resurgence with the roast. And believe me, I have nothing against roast. The best ones are always fucking crazy. Roaster Ron Jeremy was the only one I've been to. Thanks, Rob. Awesome fucking event. Uh, it, it's first and the second thing I wanted to address was two of my comic friends are going to be are, are trying are vying for positions as roasters. Uh, Tony Hinchcliffe and Tyler Morrison are both vying for position now. Hopefully, Comedy Central will take notice and 
take those two comics as their top picks in this, fucking Tony is hectic, to say the least. He's he's a monster when it comes to comedy. He's one of the only guys I know who who fucking is is constantly busy with work. Like I've been trying to get him on my podcast for a year, not happening. He's so busy, whether it's with being almost casted in Book of Mormon or going on tour with Rogan. Dude's a busy guy. 